We joined the Mungano Federation in the year 1996. What we were doing mostly was advocate, advocating for land. Because uh, by then we had uh, so many problems. When you want to put even a structure or a small thing within a place where you are staying so that you can uh, get an earning there, then you are being resisted by the local authorities. So we had to advocate in so many ways, in so many places. Uh, we went as far as going to other areas uh, like uh, Kahawa, Soweto, and so and, and uh, Kamae. By then, uh, the land was there. Ne uh, the land in Kamae, was well, it is a land just next to Kenyatta University. That land was having a very big problem, and there was always uh, a fracas. People were, we are, were being dragged by some land grabbers. So we had to go there and uh, defend uh, our members from being uh, grabbed. But unfortunately, when we were doing uh, those kind of exercises, one of the members was killed when we were trying to advocate for that land. We were not using any tool, but we were just using our, our voices. We were making noise. We could run here and there saying whatever we can say about somebody so that you leave us in peace. So in fact we were doing this when, when the, the lady was gunned down by one of the policemen. Then we, in fact it took us time to think what we, can, we could do. We had to take the, the body from the mutuary and to, we took it up to the provincial commissioner's office. And that is part of the advocacy we were doing. The year 2001, when the, the president, the former president, Daniel Arap Moy, was just passing around there, he was doing his fun, normal functions of try, visiting people. When he passed there, he, he just decided to stop at, abruptly at Korokocho and said, the people of Korokocho today, from today, have given you this land. And everybody was very happy. Because all these things, we, even, even if the president said that, advocacy that we did as the federation is the, is the main, uh, in fact, this is, that is what brought everything in order, so that the president could manage to get the members of Korokocho being sustainable. Otherwise, there were so many people who were writing letters and doing everything, telling us that we should move from there because the land doesn't belong to us.